SpaceX experienced a dramatic setback when a test of their Raptor 2 engine at the McGregor, Texas facility ended in a fiery explosion. This incident is crucial for understanding the challenges and risks involved in developing cutting-edge space technology. This video will delve deeper into the details of the explosion, exploring the complexities of the Raptor engine and its role in the Starship program. We'll analyze the sequence of events, discuss the technical aspects that might have contributed to the failure, and explore the potential impact on SpaceX's development timeline. SpaceX faced an unexpected challenge when a test of their Raptor 2 engine ended in a dramatic explosion at their McGregor, Texas facility. The test began like any other, with engineers and enthusiasts tuning in via NASA Spaceflight's livestream to watch the powerful engine go through its paces. However, what started as a routine test quickly turned into a dramatic event. The engine shut down abruptly, and soon after, vapors began to seep out, leading to a secondary explosion. The test stand was engulfed in flames and thick smoke, a stark visual of the volatility and high stakes involved in rocket testing. To fully appreciate the complexity of the incident, it's essential to understand the sequence of events that led to the explosion. Initially, the Raptor engine was operating as expected, but an anomaly caused it to shut down. This shutdown was immediately followed by the leakage of vapors, likely from the liquid methane or liquid oxygen used as fuel. These vapors, when mixed, can create a highly combustible environment. The ignition of these gases resulted in a secondary explosion, which caused significant damage to the testing stand. The live stream footage provided real-time visuals of the incident, showing the rapid escalation from a minor issue to a full-blown explosion. This sequence underscores the delicate balance required when handling such potent and volatile fuels. It also highlights the thin margin for error in rocket engine testing, where even minor leaks can lead to catastrophic outcomes. Incidents like this are critical learning opportunities for SpaceX and the broader aerospace industry. While the immediate reaction might be one of concern, it's important to recognize that failures are a fundamental part of the iterative process that drives technological advancement. The Raptor engine is a cornerstone of SpaceX's ambitious Starship program. Unlike traditional rocket engines, which often use a combination of RP-1, a refined form of kerosene and liquid oxygen, the Raptor engine uses liquid methane and liquid oxygen. This choice of fuel is not arbitrary. Methane is more efficient and, importantly for SpaceX's long-term goals, can be produced on Mars. This aligns with SpaceX's vision of creating a sustainable presence on the Red Planet where in-situ resource utilization ISRU will be key to long-term survival and exploration. Given the advanced and complex nature of the Raptor engine, there are numerous potential causes for the explosion. One plausible explanation is a leak in the engine's fuel system. The Raptor engine operates at incredibly high pressures and temperatures, which means that even a small defect or anomaly can have significant consequences. The mixture of methane and oxygen if not controlled precisely, can create a highly combustible environment, leading to explosions like the one observed. Experts from various aerospace forums and news outlets, such as Gizmodo, have speculated that the explosion was likely due to a gas leak. The high energy nature of the Raptor engine means that any leak, especially involving methane or oxygen, can quickly escalate into a dangerous situation. The exact cause of the leak, whether it was due to a manufacturing defect, material failure, or an operational oversight will be the focus of SpaceX's ongoing investigation. Despite the dramatic nature of the incident, it offers invaluable lessons for SpaceX. Each test, whether successful or not, adds to the knowledge base and helps engineers refine their designs. In this case, the explosion provides critical data on the Raptor engine's performance under stress. Analyzing the sequence of events that led to the explosion will help engineers identify weak points in the design and develop solutions to mitigate similar risks in the future. One key aspect of SpaceX's approach to engineering is their willingness to embrace failure as part of the development process. This philosophy is evident in their iterative design and testing cycles, where each failure is seen as an opportunity to learn and improve. 
The data gathered from this explosion will inform future iterations of the Raptor engine, making it safer and more reliable. Despite the recent explosion, SpaceX remains committed to moving forward with their ambitious testing schedule. The fourth test flight of the Starship system is slated for June 5th, and it comes with high expectations. This flight is crucial for demonstrating the full capabilities of the Starship system, including the Super Heavy Booster and the Starship Upper Stage. The main goals are to achieve a controlled entry of the Starship spacecraft and a soft splashdown of the Super Heavy Booster in the Gulf of Mexico. SpaceX has made significant hardware and software upgrades based on the lessons learned from previous flights. These upgrades are designed to improve the reliability and performance of the system, addressing issues that have been identified in earlier tests. The success of the fourth test flight is pivotal for SpaceX's plans to use Starship for a variety of missions, from launching satellites to deep space exploration. While the explosion is a notable event, it is not expected to delay the upcoming test flight significantly. SpaceX has built a robust testing and development framework that allows them to quickly adapt and make necessary changes. The company is confident that the recent incident has provided valuable data that will help them improve the Raptor engine and ensure the safety of future flights. The ability to swiftly recover from setbacks and continue with their testing schedule is a testament to SpaceX's resilience and determination. This proactive approach minimizes the impact of failures on their overall timeline and keeps the program on track. However, it is important to note that regulatory approval and weather conditions could still affect the launch schedule. SpaceX is working closely with regulatory bodies to ensure all necessary safety measures are in place for the test flight. The upcoming test flight is not just another milestone, it is a critical step in proving the viability of the Starship system. Success in this test would validate the extensive design changes and upgrades made to the system, bringing SpaceX closer to its goal of creating a fully reusable spacecraft. This reusability is key to reducing the cost of space travel and making it more accessible. Moreover, the ability to achieve a controlled entry and soft splashdown will demonstrate the robustness of the Starship's design. These capabilities are essential for future missions, including crewed missions to the Moon and Mars. By proving that the system can reliably return to Earth or another celestial body, SpaceX will be able to build confidence among potential customers and partners. In summary, the recent explosion during the Raptor engine test is a stark reminder of the challenges and risks inherent in space exploration. However, it also highlights the relentless pursuit of innovation and safety that drives SpaceX and the aerospace industry as a whole. By learning from each incident and continuously improving their technology, SpaceX is paving the way for a future where space travel becomes more routine and accessible. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated on the latest developments in space news, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell.